New table sizes, no problem. Game mats got your back. <laughs> Bits. <laughs> Welcome back, hobby maniacs. I'm Rob Bear from SpikyBits.com, and we're taking another look at GameMat.eu's latest offerings. The new 40K is here, ushering uh, in a new table size for the game. And if you haven't taken some masking tape to your existing 4x6 table and want to pick up some new mats, that are the correct size for 2000 points uh, strike force games well gamemat.eu has you covered now they sent us uh, one each of their new table mat sizes and these actually sold out already like they they straight sold the f out of these things and, and i was like yo i need some of those mats let, let me get a video and they're like okay we can only send you one right now because you know normally we trade to do these videos and stuff i'm like that's fair give me some when you get them back in stock so hopefully by the time you see this video they will be back in stock on their website and you can scoop up the second wave uh that hopefully will be in very soon let's jump over to the site and take a closer look at all the styles so if you haven't been to GameMount.eu, <laughs> what are you waiting for? Uh, this site is dope. It's got all sorts of uh, different things to check out. Pre-painted terrain, we showed you a lot in the past. All sorts of battle mats. Um, just tons of stuff on here to just really dig through in all sorts of varieties. And of course, they got the new releases. We showed you this stuff here on this page recently. The high balls as well look uh, pretty great. Um, Fallout Zone set. So there's all sorts of things out there that uh, it's just amazing that you can do on your tabletop for not a lot of dollars. Now, remember, they do ship out of uh, the Czech Republic, but it's basically just like getting stuff from the West Coast. If you live on the East Coast, it takes about the same amount of time, like about a week and a half. It ain't too bad at all. Trust me. Jumping over to the Battle Mats tab, you can see, whoops, <laughs> you can see how to not screw up. Uh, you can see all of the six designs here. Now, a couple of popular ones, Quarantine Zone and Fallout Zone. I don't know which one's my favorite. I'd probably lean towards Fallout Zone, but these have been favorites of ours for the last five, uh, six years or so. Sands of Time and Lost World, they just did a double up mat of that one. Then you got Chem Zone, Highlands and War, and the two big ones right here. So 65 euros for uh, the 44 by 60 inch mat right there. Uh, here you can kind of see a little bit of closer look, but I've showed you all these mats before. Really, it just kind of comes down to, hey, how do they look on a tabletop? Now, the cool thing about these mats is, well, it's that basically they're going to deflect light. They're going to deflect your dice. They're going to save your miniatures if you drop them. Uh, they roll up. They store in like no time flat. Uh, they, <laughs> they can double as a cleanup device if you spill your beverage. Well, they will soak that up as well. Um, I haven't tried washing them in the washer, though. I have, uh, they're pretty much made of the same material as uh, mouse pads, but uh, a little bit more resilient, and I think just, no, nah, it's about the same thickness. I think it's about 8 ml, uh, mm's right there. So this little guy, I have washed in the washer and dryer several times. He's a, he's an oldie but a goodie, and I imagine you can do the same thing uh, with the game map mat. So let's jump to the back into the studio and see how they look laid out with some terrain. These are the new 44 by 60 mats from GameMat.eu. We just rolled them out to take a look, and man, those colors are popping. I am a little jelly because uh, that uh, quarantine zone is not as poppy as that quarantine zone right there. So whatever they're doing on the new prints, well, I definitely prefer those to my old prints because these things don't get much sun, that's for sure. Uh, each one of these mats is going to come with uh, one of these little baggies right here, which you know should be the exact size uh, to transport them around in, in a little uh, plastic seal there, so you know it's uh, it's good to go. And um, yeah, well, let's roll them out and uh, kind of take a closer look at them. Well, actually, <laughs> well, actually, before I lay these out, I wanted to remind you guys once again, you don't have to replace your old 4x6 mat if you can just get some uh, black masking tape with like a low tack and just kind of lay it out. You can actually mask off your existing mats. But if you want to have one of the new fresh mats with those really vibrant colors, you can always pick them up from GameMat.eu as well. And there is the quarantine zone all laid out on top of the masked off quarantine zone, which isn't as poppy underneath. I'm very sad. I can't say enough good things about the quality of this. And this is actually a new design, I noticed. Like, there's elements on here we've never seen before. Uh, I think over here in this corner, there's some crazy ruins, some more rust effects and things right here. So not only are they making newer sizes, but they're going back and they're tightening up the design and making it look even fresher. 
Up next is the Highlands in War. I don't remember the exact layout of this one, so I can't tell you if there's any new design elements on it, but it looks great and it's very, very vibrant as well. It's a nice, great green battlefield with a little bit of brown and a little bit of gray mixed in, so it'll work great. Probably for Badlands and probably also, um, uh, what's that other set? Highlands, well duh, for the Highland terrain set as well. Then we've got the ubiquitous Fallout Zone. This is my favorite, I think, Matt, of all of them. No new design elements, but it fits perfectly in that 44 by 60 uh, area as well. And man, this thing just looks very, very vibrant and very, very crisp. Uh, terrain, most of the terrain would work well with this one too. Uh, maybe not the Highlands terrain set, but you can pretty much put any of it on this from that point. And last, but... Certainly not least is the new Sands of Time version two. Uh, great, great looking mat. You've already seen uh, the other double-sided version of this one for the four by six table we showed you in our last video. This one is basically the same thing, just kind of shrunk down to the appropriate uh, new 40K Strike Force uh, kind of size right there. And you can see it fits in all the borders of the 44 by 60 size. And it's got this really great uh, poppy brown yellow color that will, well, uh, I mean, it'll work great with most of the terrain, definitely the Badlands terrain. Uh, the new Rocky Base terrain. If you have some of the stuff that they made for Legion that I don't think they offer anymore, this would work great for it as well. Um, and you know, all the runes terrain would definitely work well, the chem zones and that um, the medieval stuff as well. So great, great looking mats. And there's more on the way as well. I already saw that they had more on pre-order. I think uh, uh, chem zone as well is, is a, a, a table that they're gonna come out with. I think there was one more, but I forget which one. But uh, overall, check it out, gamemat.eu. They got all the mats, they got all the terrain, they got everything you need to get started playing and spend more time playing and less time hobbying on your tabletop. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching. Uh, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you can be the very first to like and comment on all our videos.